had time to read the packet. I, I think they just saw tax forms and got the fence. I mean, yeah, ready? Yeah, I just started the recording. So this is okay. ghosts in Houston, <laughs> Texas. I'm talking NASA here. Okay, maybe the administrator, not just the magistrate, not just the judge, but the administrator flee and jump in her car and leave during court. So how do we do it, ghost? Uh, so so anyway, uh, from the top. So I'm just uh, I'm sitting down. I'm through my paperwork, putting everything in order. I'm sitting down. Uh, people laugh, what, or whatever, what's whatever. In your, what's in your paperwork? Let's go over uh, everything that's in your packet. 15 227 39 49 a 4506A, um, 8300. It was a seven, F, F, W7, W8, W9. FR2046. FR2046. Uh, 8300. Yeah, I mentioned 8300. 8300. The 433A, the 433B. Right. Right. 433A, 433B. 211911. 211911. Uh, my national, my American national paperwork, I just put that to the, put, put it to the window. Show my card again. Uh, fee schedule. Uh, Hobbs Act. You had a Hobbs Act. Did you have a public servant questionnaire? Oh uh, yes, I did. Yes, I did. Right. Did public servant. Sorry. Go ahead. Uh, Hobbs Act too. Yep. Hobbs Act. Did you did you fill out the invoice in the bill of lading, or did you just print those off and put them in your packet blank? I just put them in my packet blank, but I put my name. Some of them I put my name on there. Some of them I put like the ticket number, which which the court says the case number. So, okay. Anything so, else in this packet? Um, I mentioned the fee schedule, the Hobbs Act. What about the um, affidavit of corporate denial? Oh, I put all that up in there too. Affidavit of court. Yeah, I put that in there too. Okay. Took me a little minute to print it out and find it, but uh, it's up in there. And it's you made about eight there. copies, you said, and you brought in eight copies into court. Probably like eight. Hey, don't hey. No cap, for real. It was probably like eight to twelve copies, for okay. real. Okay, so you walk into court and take us to tell us how it goes. So, so, uh, so how all these copies uh, walk into court? So they they ask for the name, ask for the name. I say, uh, well, that's not a name. Um, that's what these people call me. My mom called me that. So whatever, what y'all want to do? So. Go to the window, administrator. They say administrator. Cops standing around, clerk. Everybody running their mouth. Um, so she say, uh, "What is your name?" And I say, "Who is who name? What is your name? Who are you?" You know. So, and I say, "By the way, I'm coming for a special appearance for this matter uh, on behalf of this matter." And she say, uh, "What is your name? Do you have a name?" She said, you have too many months of paperwork. We're going to do this for May 16th. Uh, well, you can talk to the prosecuting attorney. I say, well, I'm not talking to a prosecuting attorney. Are you going to talk to a prosecuting I said, where's the prosecuting attorney anyway, by the way? Don't, don't you supposed to be talking to her and me, seeing how this case is going to go, you know? And she started screaming. I was like, so you screaming? I'm not mad. Why are you mad? She said, well, you have too much papers. What is that? And I say, what is that? I'm. I say, matter of fact, back to judge. Your honor, I'm trying to come in, honor, but you screaming and you hooping and hollering. <clears throat> Excuse. Me. I say, so you doing all this? I say, this is a tax issue. So this out of my hands. It's not in my hands anymore. I don't have nothing else to do with this. I'm just turning. I just want, matter of fact, bailiff cop, bailiff, whatever you call yourself, can you please start passing this out to all the parties that's involved? Like I said, it's a tax issue. So they start asking me once again, uh, what is the name since you said your mom used to call you that? I said, man, my mom deceased. Don't please don't put my mom in this. She don't have nothing to do with it. I almost cursed. I'm not going to lie. So I was just like, well, 
Beverly is gone. Beverly is dead. She's deceased. Don't stop bringing my mom up. You know, I'm, I'm trying to be respectful in this courtroom. As y'all call it a courtroom. Is this a real court? Yes, I did ask that. Because I didn't see no flags. No United States of America flags. I took pictures everywhere. And she fleed, she fleed up out of there. She ran out of there. You know, she ran out of there. She didn't want even me. Matter of fact, the, the, the cop kept talking. Clerk kept talking. I said, well, I got a few schedules for you. I got the Hobbs Act. And he said, oh, 1951. I said, well, it's still accurate. So what y'all want to do with it? You do whatever you want to do with it. Deal with it. The cop took it in his office. Oh, uh, whoever Katie was. So I guess Katie, the prosecuting attorney. Well, I'm going to have Katie look over. Uh, clerk said, oh, we need an envelope for this. I said, uh, it's too thick for an envelope. So y'all figure out, figure that out. She ran her ass up out of there. Excuse my friend. She ran out. She drove up. Yeah. So she skirted off like she was being shot at. <laughs> And she told you what on the way out? She said, be safe. So now I got to watch my fucking back. <laughs> the administrator told me to be safe. What did JW say is probably going to happen? Oh, uh, so uh, she going to try to get the, I think JW said something about the crackheads. She's going to get her crackheads in uh, Houston and try no, to come in. No, 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 no. He said he knows somebody else that did something similar to this. And when I went and checked the next court date, it didn't exist. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. He said, yeah, he said when he checked the next court date, it didn't it didn't exist because she knew exactly what them, them papers were. That's why she started sending her guns out. You know what I'm saying? To check. To check, see what I was doing. Oh, yeah. By the way, back to not to go backwards. So I uh, so I'm sitting down from the falling through my paperwork. Whatever, trying to put everything in order. I got frustrated. Whatever, it was too much. It's a fucking big stack. So, so putting it, I hear him cussing in the in the background. What would that do right there? I I, I hear the judge, clerk. You know, they just having like a little cuss party. They like um, cussing. Yeah, they they cussing. <laughs> yeah, cussing, saying, "Well, this dude with this lawful shit, and this and that, and this and that. This dude with this lawful shit, he he uh." He gotta be last. He's he's gonna have to be last. I don't know what we're gonna do with this. <laughs> we gotta fix this. <laughs> so I knew I had the ass. I just knew I had them. So I was okay. thinking on my clothes. Well, how, this is before court. Yeah, this is before court. How did they know what you what was in your packet? Because I said on I said on the end. The end next to the door. <laughs> I wanted them to see. I told you, Holly, this shit check, this shit chest, not checks. <laughs> I wanted them to see. I'm like, yo, dad, yo, dad, Holly, KT, yo, dad. He said, drop them papers accidentally, but you're doing it on purpose. And where they can see it. So, me being smart, I just started. Put it in order, put it in order, boom, 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 boom. I got stuck, got tired of seeing black and white paper shit. So I started stacking them together. I had paper clips on them, like you told us how to do the W4. You know, some of them wasn't, some of them wasn't in order, but anyway, but like I said, I put my name or either the, the ticket number on them. The court said it was the case number, so I'm going with that. But the end of the story, she skirted her ass so She ran out. And but you've been over here. Court. You've been over here as a member for under a year. Right. <laughs> under a year. Where, oh yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Look, look, not to cut you off. So so it was originally it was three charges on one ticket. A skewered license plate, you know, I had tape over. Like my uh, no insurance and no, well, I said no, no insurance and then failure to financial responsibility. And, and, and you know the, the rule of boxing, right? 
Hold on, y'all. Ghost. Ghost. Yeah, I'm here. Just talking about the sun. What's up? You know, What's up? You know, you know it's the okay. boxing, right? Yeah, yeah. I took a little kung fu street fighting and all that. Yeah. No, no, trying no, with my nephew no, too. No, the four corners. What's up? The rule of boxing. Yeah. Anything in a box is removed from the page, right? Okay, okay, I got you. So when you hold that pink ticket up in this courtroom and say, Judge, there's nothing written on this, she's gonna know what you're talking about. The rule of boxing. Okay. So that'll probably I think they're probably gonna shove it off the table. Well, what did Smoke and Baby tell you how to handle the how to handle the um, financial responsibility? Do you remember? Uh, yeah, I know it's on recording, but he said uh, he said take he said get your packet the same what you issued out, bring it up to the court, right? I'm trying to remember else what he said. He said remember bring it up to the court. To he told you to use your social security number as the insurance policy and tell them to order you uh, to get more insurance if the social security number is not adequate insurance. Oh, uh, okay, okay. I remember that now. I'm gonna go back and listen to that recording though too. So well, because we're, she... making, we're making the recording now that's gonna be attached to it all. I don't right. know what the recording is. The judge cannot order you to contract with anybody. Right. Oh, she said, be safe too, walking out the door. I ain't mad at that. She said, be safe. Be safe. <laughs> if I say it before ass. I'm saying it again, be safe. I say, I told her, you be safe. You be safe too. I wanted to say, what the fuck you mean? <laughs> Excuse me, y'all. That, so you're implied, gonna charge her that, $2,000 a minute around the clock. So you can be Cause safe. she talking walking out the door. I forced it. I forced the hand. <laughs> I wonder what the the penalty uh, to a judge would be for, like that was an implied threat from, I don't know, was it from the bench or was it from the woman? Like the know, woman who was walking at the door saying, "He said, be safe." That's probably why she did yeah. that. Yeah, so she's like, whoa, you know, uh, that's the Hobbs Act right there, isn't it? Like using her her bench as power. And other thing I want to this this the foot standing forward. Um, I felt like we'll putting the right foot forward a bit. Like you don't when you're standing on a, a ship, you don't stand with your feet like shoulder width. You always have them like juxtaposed. Because that's a better balance position. Like any martial artist knows, you know that that's 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 a pretty good point to start from. And uh, anybody that's that sailed or been on a ship, so when you make that stance and you put those that paperwork where you did, and I love that one about the the uh, sin card, like holding that up, you know, as the you know as the appearance, right? That's that is just so so brilliant. Like it's so simple. I love things that are simple and, and brilliant like that. One other thing. So we were talking to Smoking Baby a little while ago about um, like putting Smoking Baby for president on the bottom left uh, corner of the uh, the presentation envelope. <clears throat> and so I was thinking, man, like Polly was saying, we're just gonna get out about this. And now you got a document. So it sounds like he just goes 24, just goes to the judge. So on all court documents, probably on the bottom, I don't know, bottom left, bottom right, but, you know, goes 24. <laughs> All court, <laughs> you know. Yeah. Case dismissed. Yeah. 
<laughs> on your guys' court documents, put ghost 24. <laughs> yeah. You're all getting you um, perhaps. Come on. <laughs> no, but it's all good. It's all good. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Yeah, I just I just went in there with confidence, like you said. I just, I just had to, you know, most times I stand alone anyway. Like I say, because my kids, they just be like, my boys just be like, shit, I really respect my dad because he got his paperwork and he stand on his shit, you know? So I just started reading. I'm a rookie at this, so, but I just started back reading since I've been out of, uh, I'm gonna lie, I've been out of work for like two months. You know, and uh, I was about to do Instacart in. You know, they finally, I guess they looked at what I, in the system. <laughs> so they like, okay, we're going to get this dude a job. A rookie just made the judge run out. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, yeah, she's scary though. <laughs> it's like she pissed on <laughs> That's why I was like, man, I need that Holly to be there where she can really, really believe me for real. This shit gonna probably be on the news. I'm for real. I, I really think it's, it might hit the damn news. <laughs> yeah, she ran out like IRS CID was busting in the back door. Man. She had really? no good excuse to flee up out of that courtroom like that. She knows what the 8300 is. She knows what those other documents are. The clerk was telling her. The clerk's the high banker for the court. That's clerk business. You got to read clerk's praxis to know what all that's all about. So she probably did and she probably knew and she could predict the future, except she thought she was going to play the name game. But that didn't work. And the packets were for her, <laughs> for the interested parties. It's just unbelievable. She's probably in Mexico by now. Yeah, she probably fled the fucking country. Man, I wanted to see where she, where she went. I'm just like, shit, I hope I don't do no Instacart at the house. <laughs> shit. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> so hopefully, I W40 do this 1040 on it. Oh, man. <laughs> the, nature, the nature of those forms showed her that you know she fraud and so is the court right and you didn't even have foreign agent registration paperwork request or a download a copy of the fara act right. you, didn't mention, you didn't mention an oath of office or demand to see their bond no well, you just brought in some tax forms <laughs> Whoa. i say this is a tax issue <laughs> I'm not, I say, I'm not talking to no prosecutor. <laughs> How many times did you tell him it was a tax issue? I kept telling him. I kept telling him. And I kept telling him, y'all gonna keep running, if y'all gonna keep running the mouth while the, while the administrator, the judge is talking, if your honor is talking, I'm gonna hit y'all, keep hitting y'all with these fee schedules. And the Hobbs Act, he kept saying 1951. I said, okay. So I take it, you the chief of police, like you the judge. <laughs> This dude got a gun now. You know what I'm saying? He got a he got backup too. The backup didn't say shit. He ain't said nothing. <laughs> say they, don't they don't comprehend. They don't comprehend any right. of it. Right, right, right. Just the fact that he says 1951 shows you his level of intelligence. <laughs> I mean, he was say, just admitting how stupid he was. So, so, so he said, "What is your name?" I said, you see, see, I said, read it, read it. <laughs> I said, read it. <laughs> I said, you got like, you stopping me like, like, oh, I don't even remember the, um, the dude was there. Maybe that was the dude sitting back not saying nothing. The one that stopped me, I'm, I'm thinking now. That could have been the dude, you know, that, that stopped me. Well, no, no, matter of fact, the, the, the actual dude. So, so if it's not a person that stopped you, there, aren't that case supposed to be dismissed? That's what I thought. You know, the person that arrested you or gave you the ticket, if they not there, don't, don't, don't they thought the case supposed to go away. Dismissed, right? I, I think don't know. I'm just... the case go away. Yeah. 
Yeah, they're cool. used to see that. I, I don't think they do it unless you bring it up. Oh, uh, okay, okay. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's a it's a few points I could have could have mentioned, you know, injured party is that injured party, um, emergency lights on. It wasn't All right, that's what I was saying. That, that paperwork, you know what I'm saying? It it, it uh took you right above that in the beginning. I mean, right, it, the, 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 uh, the paperwork did its thing. You know, once so that that meant a lot. All I know is he flew about it at court one. That's why I didn't call you right back, girl. I was just like, oh shit, I gotta breathe. I can't believe I did this. <laughs> you shocked the shit out of yourself. I'm like, damn. That's just like getting the game, winning the championship. You know what I'm saying? It was like winning the, 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 the game winner. <laughs> That's like shit you only see on YouTube 10 years after it happened. Man, man. But what's funny to me, is ghost up here asking me how should I go about this? How should I do this? And all I this. did. And I, I ain't mentioned half of the shit he done. <laughs> look, look, I was, I was even Batman. I asked Batman too. I'm like, man, Batman, what I need to do? His, his laptop. He'll tell you the story. Look, I'm back and forth with Daryl, Batman, Daryl, Batman. I was like, shit, man, I'm gonna work. I'm like, Daryl, bro, send me this. Send me this. <laughs> oh, my oh my god. Now it's making me learning how to do the forms, making me think about the identity theft class, other class we had. And I'm just like, shit. Oh my God. <laughs> hey, when you when you're in court, you know, you, you just you just gotta. It's like you on a uh, on a chess table. You know what I'm saying? Like you gotta think. You gotta think. You know what I'm saying? And I'm glad I had my hands in front of me. I wasn't moving giving them a permission to be able to shoot. I'm surprised that they stood down. I'm still surprised that they still started back. They were just talking. They were just talking. And they was moving while she was she was talking. I'm like, they were supposed to so and it could be why she was distracted, but she was all over the damn place. Well <laughs> she, this is the <laughs> shit that got Wesley Snipes out of a jam. Oh yeah, because he was uh yeah, he was going through it. <laughs> so you said that's what got him out? Oh shit. Oh man, KT. Yeah, Mr. KT. Man, man, I, I I still thank you for that. And I don't mean the key, like I say, you said act like you you uh dropping the papers. <laughs> the clerk said, excuse me. <laughs> she walked Take around. Whole, do the same thing Holly did when she taught him a lesson out in New York. She right. took the whole damn courtroom over and filled all the tables up with paperwork and had them all running around helping her put this together. And Man. some of those the, uh, cops and state patrols lost their jobs. And she gave them a class how to read signs. <laughs> Right, exactly. And, and I and I told them what signs to put up to effectuate what message they're trying to send. Right. That's what's up. Right. And they you. did it three times before they got you that morning, and they do it five hundred times a month. Shit, man, shit, so out of better get them, Holly. <laughs> hey, so KT, that was you with the Hobbs Act thing. Was that you, Shet, or was that Kevin? Somebody you know named Kevin, or was that you with the Hobbs Act thing? Because I remember oh, you the one mentioned the Hobbs Act. That's why. I, that's why. Devastating. I, it's already a indictment. Man, it's devastating to read. Everybody man. should have a Hobbs Act printed up and put in their car in their binder. Mm hmm. Right. Too shady. Too shady. Man, man, for real. That's real talk. That's for real. Remember the uh, my dad's friend who's a constable took the Hobbs Act to the judge, and the judge told him that if that Hobbs Act got out, it would shut down Myrtle Beach. That's the story, right? Yeah, that's that's the story. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And 
So the shockwave already went through the judicial community. They're on to the, and, and that judge got every son of a bitch to get an oath of office in Myrtle Beach or the whole county. And so my friend's got a copy of a fresh oath of office from people that have been dead for 10 years. <laughs> wow. That's amazing, man. Is there well, any questions? Is there any questions definitely. on the court? Is there any questions on the court case before I stop the recording? Court quick case uh, questions? Yeah. Was she wearing black robes? I don't I don't remember that. I remember my having some clothes on, if I'm not mistaken. I don't remember her having no robe on. She probably had like a dress on. And not and not like the uh the judge dress. Uh, I don't remember that. I just remember her having like some regular like a dress on. And I'm like, I wanted to say, wait, wait, where you uh where you judge the type? Because it said it said on the um uh, on the paper, you know, the, the ticket. Said on the ticket, uh tire. I came in with t-shirt shorts on with my boot on, you know, toes up at my ankle <laughs> and my other shoe on. <laughs> I just came in that summer wear, you know. Like, shit, I'm like, man, I'm halfway shaved. <laughs> like, you know, when you go on court, you're like, yeah, you know, I can put a suit on. You don't have to do all that. You know? The Bible say it I ain't even all into the Bible. I'm not holy than that, but. No offense who I, but uh, I I was raised up in the church though too. Be respectful and all that. But I just was like, you know, what they say, God says, come as you are. You know what I'm saying? So raised in a, in a Christian church, ventured out to a Baptist church. But anyway, I just I was like, I'm going that one I thought about, I'm like, man, I need to maybe get some dress clothes, but I'll forget all. It's too hot. <laughs> I'm gonna go in there and be myself, hold my head up, motivation. I was just. Just trying to stay on my square, y'all. You know, but as you kept with the being in honor, calling him judge, so he, he accepted that off that right. instead of calling him sir. Right. I never let that uh came out of my mind. I I probably call the cops and in in a in a clerk, ma'am and sir, because they kept running their mouth. You know what I'm saying? And, and I was like, uh, keep running your mouth. I think you want to be a witness. Do you want to be a witness? So if you want to be a witness, you deserve a fee schedule. That, uh, that was threatening. Say what? So that was threatening. No, I asked him. I say, would you like to be That's a witness? A That's a threat, though. That's a threat. I mean, um, wasn't trying to. <laughs> was just but but judicial, threat, judicial proceedings can never be perceived as a threat. Mm. I'm saying that asking her to be a witness and and, and the fee schedule was going up. Yeah, that shut her up. Yeah, because it it was just like, well, she what she said, she said. But you know, I asked for it. I'm not gonna lie. So I so I I was like, um, do you need anything else, clerk? Because I forgot I said, I forgot your name, but do you need anything else? Remember I had you this, remember I had you that. You need anything else? What's in that box? I can add to it. She said, "Well, I have, I have your records. I have your records." They stopped calling me by the name. They stopped calling me, so they tried to play the name game by calling me my middle name, because you know, on the driver's license, have the original way it say last name, first name, middle name. So they tried to trick me. I didn't say yes to it. Uh, thank you, you know, for the nice, you know, people say nice, nice pronouncing, yeah, or thank you, because my last name, people, they don't pronounce it correctly. So when she said my middle name correctly, I didn't, I didn't correct it. I, I mean, I didn't, I didn't acknowledge it, you know, I just did. So you I know? think it's likely that she didn't yet establish jurisdiction. I think it's clear clearly that she didn't. That's why she probably ran out. And that, and I don't know. I think like JW thinks there ain't going to be no other court date. If right. There is, Three I'm sure charges in one. See. Huh? My bad, Holly. My bad. My bad. 
No, go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you up. Three charges and 